Hello, Debbie here from Easy Piano Styles. And let me make sure that that is actually recording. I think it is. Okay, how are you today? Today's lesson is on something that you see a fair amount in music for minor chords. And it's this, I'll demonstrate it first, then explain it. Let's do this on a D minor. Motion. We start off with a D minor, I'm doubling the root on the top. And then I'm bringing it down a half a step. That's called a minor major chord. It's a minor triad with a major seventh on the top. So it's a, if you saw it written in a fake book, it would say D minor and in parentheses major seventh. And then here's a regular D minor seven. And he's a, here's a D minor six which is a half a step below the seventh or a whole step above the fifth, however you want to think of it. So it's that sound. Now that could be put on, uh, you could do it this way, by dropping the pinky down and just keeping the F and the A. We'll play you some songs where you would hear that. Um, My Funny Valentine. that song without having that movement. You, you could go, you know, think how awful that sounds. Right? In a sentimental mood. I'll start off with this. Thank you, Gellington. Cry Me a River. Now you say you love me. I'll put the melody up here. Okay, so those would be written into the charts, but you could actually use that and put that in a song where you have a minor chord. For example, uh, the, the James Van Heusen song, Come Fly With Me. Here's a D minor. And it goes to a G7, we could go. And it ends to the G. a minor chord. Um, let's say you have a song, Here's That Rainy Day, another Van Heusen song. We have... Okay, funny, that's a D minor, and it goes... We could go... on a minor chord. Just go, especially, especially if it's going to the dominant seventh chord. It goes right into that, so for D minor seven. And then it goes right into the G7. If it didn't go into the G7, it stayed on the D minor. You could still do it because it would be the sixth of a D minor. So, see if you can find places, you can try it out on those songs, My Funny Valentine, In a Sentimental Mood, Cry Me a River. Um, there are other places. I just thought of another one. Um, can you recognize this? Michelle from the Beatles. Perfect example. Just thought of that on the spot. Okay. Um, and then just try it out on places where you have minor chords. It's a really pretty sound. It's that subtle half-step chromatic movement going down, which is really, really pretty. Okay, have a great day, and I will talk to you next time. Bye-bye.